G'day and welcome to Planet Coaster and it's a spooky kind of Halloween type of feeling here and it's Stitch Up. So Stitch Up's here, forget, cut the scary voice, Stitch Up is back with a brand new series uh, in Planet Coaster. So this will be a short series, a mini series if you will. This is going to be a Halloween project. So I'm starting this around the 5th or 6th of October um and then oh can you can you hear the scary music in the background hopefully it's not too loud uh and then um we are going to uh create a nice little uh actually let's get creating a nice little small park um and it's gonna have a spooky theme it's gonna have a halloween theme so yes we'll go up to around 31st of october um i'm feeling exceptionally inspired because i'm in um we got sandbox here yep uh sandbox and grassland please and let's call this spooky uh spooky how about a very spooky Halloween so original that one brilliant very spooky Halloween so yes I'm feeling well inspired because I'm in London and uh, they do take their um, uh, yeah their um, Halloween very serious they take Christmas very serious and we may do a Christmas park um, and so yeah this is brilliant uh, actually if I can just um, have a bit of a think about what we're gonna do here might just see if I can turn the music. I just I'm hoping that turns the music down a bit, but keeps my voice up a bit, which might be cool. Uh, let me just see. I'm not sure if that will actually work, but <laughs> we'll find out. Okay, so um, now I want um, basically going to have the park um, is going to have a nice little windy path at the start, but we'll connect that up in a little bit. Um, and most of this is going to be in um, the night time, so it'll be building during the day, and then we'll be taking a lot of the video shots at night time um, and having a look at that and sunset and things like that. So I think what we'll do is we'll just get a bit of terrain editing and we'll go a little crazy on the terrain editing to start with um and where's the entrance to there so we need a fairly decent kind of mound here please um that'd be lovely and then if we can just get another kind of a bigger mound here in fact let's go intensity and size quite big and we can roughen and move this all around as we feel we we need we we're able to so that's kind of good um right so there's a nice little way that they can get into the the, the park so that's We'll fix all this up soon so this episode we're going to be doing just a bit of planning on this nice little park um and now i want to do a wild mouse coaster in here i want to do a bobsled coaster i want to do a um uh the go-karts uh monster themed go-karts possibly i think could be good um and so that could all be quite nice let me see if i can just get this little bit out here yeah so that's that's not too bad um if i can jaggedy up a bit but remember we don't want to over jagged because remember what happened in that first park we went a bit crazy on the jaggedy jaggedy king kong theme and it's it went a bit sort of crazy didn't it and it was just a bit much it really did get out of hand um, if we just jaggedy up this a bit and then I'll worry about the path in a sec but if I can just get a few of these kind of a few of these bits like that and then what we'll do is we'll go flatten to foundation and we'll see if we can just get a few kind of if we do it like this there we go now we can actually get some overhangs and some flat bits and these will be good to place a bit of scenery on and things like that so um, we can do that and if we go are we on foundation yeah and then if we can just get size down we can actually get the foundation path here um, and we can just do it like this because then we know that that path is going to be nice and smooth for our um, path to come along into the area so that's all good um, we might do a little creek coming in here as well um, and a little bridge spooky bridge um, so that'd be good uh, yeah so there's lots of plans so we got a yeah we got a, a wild mouse um, definitely possibly a dark ride but again I'm, I'm gonna be thinking about how sort of uh, let's just go if we go from here just gonna be thinking about how um, just make sure this is all 
So that would be all like that. So that I'm not, I might actually get this path right in there so we can just make sure that it fits. Um, and it's at the right level, yeah. So if I grab all this. And of course we'll have to terrain paint a lot of this as well. But let's just see if we got if we got all this. This is kind of ironing out. This is like ironing. It's like it increases out of the um, of the shirt that you're ironing. Um, so that's pretty good. Um, scary music here is um, some royalty free music that I found. Um, I might actually get this path going now. So if we can just get in there, and I want this path here, and I want it to be uh, yeah, we'll go up a bit. Ooh. Let's not do that. Uh, all right, now we want uh, length and we don't want to... We don't necessarily need to... Um, just change the length up there. Don't necessarily need to... Um, what was I saying? <laughs> oh yeah, we don't necessarily need to... Uh, I can't remember what I was actually saying. Uh, I was pathing and... I think I was going to say we don't necessarily need to go in a straight path. Um, but you know what? Now I do want to go on a straight path. So let me get a bit of length there. And just... I might just put this here. Because if we can just have this go in here. We can have some sort of scene happening there, which would be really nice. Um, you know, it's Planet Coaster, so everything can change. So this is basically the entrance to the park. Um, and I think that kind of works nicely. It might actually just, if we go to rain and we go up and let's just, what we might do is ooh, just get this sort of mountain range kind of, just so we know that these people have to come in via that. And that connects up nicely as well, which is pretty good. Um, and we can fix up how this looks at some stage. Uh, can I connect that in, please? Please connect in there. No, nope. it doesn't want to do that, does it? No, okay. Well, we'll fix that. We will fix that. In fact, we'll fix that right now because that looks absolutely ridiculous. Uh, yes. So there's a nice little mound. And we've got paths. And um, Now, what's happening over there? This is bugging out a bit, is it? Is it bugging out? Uh, it is bugging out a bit, so if I just go to terrain as well, and we'll do that. Ooh, but not that. Is that is that sort of appropriate? Yeah, it's not bad. I can probably just if I do that. Could I possibly put some water in? That was an accident, actually. Uh, but let's just see if that will. Um, how about we do all that a bit, a little bit better? Yeah, it's not too bad. We could we could use um, a bit of a puddle there. Um, we could probably just take all this off and actually put a bridge in, uh, which might be nice. But I think it's kind of look, it's all adding to it at the moment. Um, let's just keep this here. So this will be stuff that we'll come back to. So we might just go back to Ruffin. Um, yep, and we'll roughen a few things up at the moment. And then I'm just gonna actually, yeah, roughen. And then I'm going to grab the foundation tool, minimize these a bit, and grab the flatten foundation and just create a few sort of tapui, a little bit of tapui, and some overhang as well, which is nice. Yeah, we can do something really cool there. So something really kind of showy. Um, and then when we want to de tapui it up, we just fix this up so we can get a ledge. And when you when I say tapui, I hope you guys are all cool with what um, what I mean there. But obviously, I mean that um, um, tapui is a very flat top, a flat top mountain. And if you create things, um, so if you go flatten to surface, it'll create whatever angle there is there. But flattened foundation always does it off that foundation part. And this flattened foundation is just see if you do it like that. It really helps us to, um, you know, be able to put stuff there. Um, and it also, you can, if you do it off the side of vertical runs, you can get a bit of formation there, which is pretty nice. So I'll do that because I like that to uh, flatten the foundations, put a few holes there and stuff. Um, okay, so I think that's pretty good. Um, I'm going to set the time for this at the moment as 10 a.m. because I want the sun to be well overhead, please. Just give me a nice little 
Yeah. And so this is all going to be lighting effects, and we can do um, we can do things like um, pumpkins and um, you know all different things that can happen for when the guests walk in through here, and they'll come through this bit, and they'll come around and they'll get to basically where the park is. We might even decide that you know do they want to? No, that's going to be a scene. There's going to be something here, yeah, a bit of a scene there, and we'll, we'll work out exactly what the scene is. We might even put the mountain here and make it a really cool kind of scene. So when we walk through, people get to have a bit of a look and see that you know there's like a, I don't know like a pirate ship or something or something. Let's maybe not lock in pirate ship, but something spooky. A spooky scene will be there, so that'll be nice. Um, and that'll be good. When you get into the park, it'll obviously be here. And if we just get nice and big, flat and found, we can actually kick off what all these kind of, and that's all, all on the same level now, please. Yeah, okay. So now I have to think about um, how I wanna set out the park and what I wanna do with, um, you know, uh, actually, what I'll do is I'll do a much bigger mountain top here. Uh, intensity, please. Yeah. Just, just, just here because this will be kind of just, just so we get some hills in the background. Um, might even put like a. It could even put like an old castle on top of it or something, and it just gives us a little bit of that to play with. So that's kind of nice. I like that. Okay, um, so we can have basically have this as a big plaza area and we can have some flat rides and things coming off here as well. So if I can come here and bring this down a bit, we keep the intensity reasonably high, flatten the foundation, and now we can just flatten some of these things out. And then just work out that this is all pretty good. Uh, yeah. All right, and I don't think the grass area is kind of helping us too. So we'll get rid of the this grass texture. I think that's kind of not really helping. Okay, uh, in fact, we can probably just get rid of a bit of that grass texture now. So if I go to, um, where is it? Ooh, terrain, and I go paint, and we can have a look here. So it's dry grass intensity. That's kind of good. Because the grass is kind of doesn't really help us. Um, if I go rocky mud, um, yeah, yeah, we'll just make all this sort of change out a bit. Because the grass kind of doesn't, it just and some dirt. Yeah, that's good. If we just 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 thin out things with some dirt and paint out some some mud mud flats and sides of sides of mountains and things okay uh, definitely don't want any grass up the top here so this is all kind of oh there's a nice I like that little look that little slip along there that's all good so I might just get rid of the grass all up top here because that should just be all kind of muddy and rocky which is good um uh, yeah we don't know if this is going to be the exact shape of the mountain but i kind of like that it's just get the intensity going there as well there that's great look at the rock face these are really good i mean the texture is ridiculous in this game um and just be careful not to spend the whole episode just painting the ground it just not quite the I'm not going to, uh, you know, it's not brilliant. Uh, oh, and then if we just create a couple of rocky bits here as well, this is this is the texture that sort of will give us a nice rock face. And uh, check me, just what's my intensity there? Yep, and if we can just... Um, And keep the mud out of the top there. I think it's that's good because the grass sort of goes, and then we get a real kind of idea for the 
the area. This area here is going to be uh, definitely a bridge. I don't like the, um, the the look of that at the moment, but we'll just leave it at the moment because um, just trying to paint out some of that stuff. And if I can get the rock in here as well, um, these rocks are going to look really good when lit up with you know blue lights and things like that. So that's kind of good. Um, okay. And what's the intensity there? Oops, yeah. And we can intersperse that with some real rocks as well. The rocky patterns. Um, right, that's good. And I think that's good. Okay, so it's a nice sort of entrance to our park. Um, we do want some sort of scene here. And then, of course, we've got our lovely... Uh, first ride. Okay, cool. So the first ride I've decided is going to be just a flat ride and we are going to have a plaza happening um, But in addition to that, let me just put this here. See if I can get some grass area um, Just get some dry grass happening got a bit of a rock thing happening there, too um, but I might actually just get to rain and ooh, Flatten the surface chisel. Okay, um, oh, hang on. Don't want that ledge. Yeah, that's what I want. I sort of don't. I think, it, yeah. Okay. Uh, flat a foundation there. That'll fill that up a bit. And of course, we do get a bit of. Um, yeah, we get a little bit of the. That. And if I can. Uh, we get a bit of. Um, the grass back but we can change this up now by putting in uh to get a bit of a dirt feeling right across here to start with get rid of those rocks dirt. the dirt looks now that looks kind of not brilliant so if we can just oh that looks even worse um what about if i go intensity right down no um what about if i go dry grass Yeah, that's kind of good because I think that kind of works. Is this area? Yeah, dry grass. Okay, that works for that area. That's nice. And that really shapes that. And in fact, if we can just adjust this, so we've got some rocks, a tiny bit more. Yeah, it's just the right sort of. There we go. Yep, getting rid of the grass. I mean, there's patches of grass up there, which is good. And yeah, patches of. And then you get these really big areas of rock like that. It will just really form those right out if I can go intensity. Um, with that, I don't know if I put the intensity right up and just see what happens. Just on that section. Just make it a kind of rocky outcrop. Yeah, it's not bad. And then we can sort of just work out um, exactly what happens here with height and stuff. So that's all nice. Okay, cool. So we've got a flat ride here, we decided. So uh, let's go to rides and put in uh, the flat ride. Now, the one I want to put in is going to be slightly square, not round. Not round, slightly square. And where is it? Mm, no, no, no. Hang on. Check this, because we're going to theme this up. This is going to be a themed ride. Um, pirate ship is a bit sort of. What's this one? Um, this ride here does look a bit. It is a bit scary. It's a bit steampunk, but it could work actually. Yeah, that could be a really good ride to put in there. Let's just see if I just. Where's the? Where, where's the little tower? Um, there's a little guy who runs it. There he is, he's right at the front there. Okay, so we can put this in. So if the plaza's all gonna be here, we can put this guy in. So he, you know, he's the first thing that they see. So let's spin him right around a bit. So you put, sort of put it like that, almost. Um, he's back to the rock wall, could be good. But a little bit of an angle as well, yeah. Um, but we do wanna tuck him away for size. And in fact, we might be able to get a path around the back there as well. So let's see if we can do this. In fact, let's see if we can go like this. 
Yep. And we want to put the entrance. Now, let me think. I want the exit to be uh, here. So if I put the entrance. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah. Okay. So the entrance is going to be here. Come in. Oh, no. The entrance can be right at the front, actually. People get to see their friends enter right at the front. And the exit, I want to be right over here. Close to this guy so the, ma the maintenance guy can get in there. And these can connect to the plaza, plaza really well. And of course, let's see what we can do. Yeah, the black is excellent. What's that one? What is that? I don't know why, but that's brilliant. Okay, let's see here. So this will be this will be uh, a queue. And on the queue, just going to check out a couple of things here. So very small queue, and I want it to be no railing on the ground path. And I'm going to do my own custom barrier as well. So that's going to be kind of, you know, I thought I might as well challenge myself a bit. Um, so if I go to three meters and snap on that, and I'll go straight out. Yep. And then it's going to be gridage, please. So here we go. So that's nice and neat too, which I love. Um, okay. So they come in there. I know it's a bit of a long queue for a flat ride, but who cares? <laughs> That's great. Um, not that, actually. That's not good. Actually, I wonder if we could just... Oh, these guys are going to be too close. Yeah, he's too close to the exit, guys. So we're just going to do this. So it'll be that, and then it'll be that. Yeah, that, that's good enough, I think. And if we can now just go here, just to finish it off. Yeah, that's nice. I love how black and dark it all is. It re looks really good again to see you've got this path and that path. I don't know what we ended up selecting. I don't know what we're on. Oh, you're on this, but why is it dark? We're on this one, but why is it so black? I don't know, but it, it really works. It's a freaking awesome path. Um, and then we got the exit path. So we'll do this one. Now, why is he, if I do that, it changes it. Why does he do that? I'm just trying to work out why these guys went so black. These two. That one's black. That one's really black. That kind of works. Now, why did we lose that? I don't know what it was, to be honest. I, I don't know where we... Um... that one isn't it it's that one yeah okay so if we go here and then here we can now do that uh, at least it's still black but it's not kind of the black that we oh it's not the black that we had though is it no that's a shame um i'll just do that one just because that works for the color that the right is and then we might as well just keep it like this as well there's the exits. Okay, cool. And then we can connect those back both up to the plaza soon. So we'll just go up to path and we'll stick on to this one. And it's going to be width of three, is it? No, four, five even. Four, five. Yeah, five. Hang on. What's that one? Length, uh, five. So we go to four. Just see if that's the same. That should be the same. Yeah. Okay, cool. And for now, we're going to just do these paths like this. And it's going to just be a case of, yep, go around and connect in with your friend there. And it'll be that. And then, yep. And then this is going to be just regular path. So it was this one. Yep. And it's just going to be connect up, please. Great. And then, of course, we've got the queue. And this is going to be here. Where was it? This one? Yep. And, and there. So that's that's really good. I don't know why that part's so black, but I love it. I don't know if the game is glitching out at the moment um, by doing it, but that's really cool. So uh, let's have a look at what we've got so far. So if we come in, come into the park, and we've got some, some stuff happening here. Um, yep. And then we're into scary path to get into that. Bit of a... Um, 
a bit of a water thing happening there. You've got some waves as well. Is that waves? Yeah, some water moving around. Water moving around makes me think something below the surface is moving around, and I like even in this light you can't sort of see the difference between the, the rock and the, the water. Um, and so that will be a bridge, don't forget. Um, we'll come around here and there'll be something that will reveal itself. So we might have to just build this mound up a tiny bit here so that it just reveals itself and you can sort of see the lights of it when you're looking through here. So, you know, um, and it'll come through here and then we'll, oh, and then we'll have a look. Oh man, I've got to get used to the controls of this game. Um, and then here, there'll be something that we'll see, something to um, take people's eyes, they come through. And then of course you come around here and we've got a lovely sort of our first ride. And this is this kind of uh, Frostpunk kind of looking ride. Now, I want to see if I can do one thing. Can I? Can I do this? Can I move it? Yeah. Okay, let me just move the ride. Keep it exactly where it was, but raise it. Yep, yeah. that's what I want. Now I just want to get it bang on straight. I don't want any changes to its height, please. So we haven't got any changes there, which is good. No, no changes to the axes. Um, let me see if I can just get that. So that should be there. I just want a bit of height to it. Um, actually, even a bit taller. Just to make those, are they stairs? Can they be stairs, please? Are they, are they ramps? If I go here, let me just see there. So they're ramps, they're ramps, and it's got a little bit of height. I want it up a tiny bit more though. Yep, they're stairs now. Stairs up, stairs down. Um, can we go up a tiny bit more? And still get stairs yes we can okay let's put it into testing open it up a bit of smoke comes out of it and there it is that's brilliant okay so let's create now um the start of this ride so we have to give it a bit of a theme so if i go here um can i start building on the grid can't do that can only do it with uh i don't think you can do that with flat rides okay cool so if i go building and i go custom and i go walls and castles yep and castle all right um well it's not really castles that we want is it hang on where's the wall castle walls for and let's see what the colors of these are going to be actually just turn around all right this is gonna be these guys okay cool so um, these castle walls are gonna be black and they're gonna be kind of gray and they're gonna be sort of second black yep <clears throat> okay now the hard bit how do we connect get this perfectly lined up um, it is pretty good. Just need to be down a tiny bit. I think that's bang on, actually. Um, right. How how do we want this to be? So let's make it like this. So that'll kind of get it going. Get the structure going a bit. Yeah. Let's see what we got here. Now, obviously, that's not going to be exactly where we want it. But if we just keep these going round. Um, We'll see exactly how big a structure we want this to be in. Um, okay, and we can work out the foundation of this structure as well. So if we just do this, this. Um, all right, let me see here. Can I get grid size, please? And we'll make it like this. Yep. And then we'll do And there's nothing to say the back part of it doesn't have to be slightly more ridiculous. So let's do this. Yep. And then Cause the back of it can be a bit bigger and it doesn't have to be exactly straight as well. It doesn't have to be sort of well, let's go straight for the moment. 
So that music's just the right amount of creepy at the moment. It's pretty good. Okay, so if we keep in line with what's happening here, line it up on the insides. Let's just see if we can get some sort of structure around this. That works. Okay. Um, and that will be good. And now what I want to do is... Oh, the colours of this is really good too. Um, so that's that. Now let me see. This should be one structure. So if I go move... Let me see if I can move it. So we want to move it so it's in the middle of those two. All right, let's just get this bang on. So it's going to be in the middle of these two. That's pretty good. And then this one, the red is going to be in the middle of these two. So red, and we want it right in the middle. So that shouldn't have adjusted that. So that's pretty good. Yeah, that's good there. And then that shouldn't have changed that. So that's excellent. And then let's drop him down a bit. So he is something like this. But we'll put him up a little bit, actually. I wonder if we could put him up to there. Is that high enough? It's not bad because... Ooh, 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 what did I do? Um, great. Now he's just right. So everything we just let me just go here and do that again. So it was in the middle of these two, and around here the red was in the middle of these two. Yep. And then the green was going to be the height. And we click and make it fix the right height. Now, now in addition to that, because I was what I was saying is when people are walking around here and these people have already come into our park, the park's not open yet. What are you doing? Oh man, um, I might have to close the park. I didn't want the people walking around. But when these people walk around, they'll see that the ride is kind of sitting inside this structure, and then it kind of raises outside of it, um, which is kind of cool. So if we turn it on, let's go into testing. And let's see it from the ground level. All those flames coming out are pretty good. And we can actually see that when the ride goes up, it comes out and it raises above. So it's good. So that's good. I think we've got like a nice sort of ride skin happening here. Okay, cool. Um, just turn the ride off for a sec, please. And in fact, I don't like it. So I want to close the park, please. Um, how did he... Let's just close that park for a second, please. Thank you very much. Everyone head back to the gates. Uh, the park is not open. You should never have come in. Um... All right, cool. That's better. I don't know what happened there. All right, let's go here. And um, we need a... Oh, what do you got there? I need some ink. A roof. Some sort of roof. Castle. Uh, hang on. Castle flat roof. Castle arch tunnel bridge piecing bit. What? Is it though? Ah, yeah. Okay, because he's got that. Uh... Yeah, that's a good that's a good piece. All right, that's the right sort of piece that I want. Now, if we go in here, we want this to be at this height. We got the um, charcoal, please. All oh, quite black, thanks. Right, and then if we got the grid grid height and size, so we can go fair way up. Um, and so we'll do this as, let me just get him right in there. Do, 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 do. And then I change this to... Uh, like this. So 
So I was worried a bit earlier about the colour of that. Um, well, not worried, but I was quite impressed with the original colour of the, the base of this um, ride. And as it turns out, I'm putting this concrete bit over it anyway, which I think really works. Um, but it wouldn't have made any difference to the colour of that. And so, yeah, I don't know why I was worried about it. Um, that's all. Is that all there? Yeah, that's all good. That is all good. Um, and jump out of it. And I, I probably just need to see if their legs are going to clip. Their legs are going to clip, actually. So what I need to do is I need to... Oh, yep, yep, yep. Okay. So I need to open the park. Yep. And I need to open the ride. Um, yep. Open the ride. And hopefully just turn it up a bit. Speed three. And let them go on here. And then if I can just do this bit, I might be able to drop that down a tiny bit so that, see how it just it just shows it. That's about as small a drop as I can get. Let's just see how they go with this step. They might, they might be right. Um, it depends where they go to walk up here. But let's see, here's some people coming now. We'll get them to go in. Oh wow, this, ro this ride is crazy, this one. Look at that. Oh man, this ride really goes off. Let's just go to speed one. Oh man, look at the ride. This ride is crazy. Spooky proper. Um, cool, okay. Um, just speed three while we get some people onto the ride. Just need at least a couple of people just to get on. It's open. Um, come on, get in there, get in there, get in there. Yep, she's walking in. Please get in so I can see your legs clipping. Uh, here they come. Speed one. She goes up the stairs. And she goes through there. And then... How does she get on? Yeah, she goes around there. Okay, cool. So we'll wait till these people get... Next people come on. And then we'll... Please go quicker. Yep, and then what we'll do... I might just pause this. Can I pause it here? Yeah, there we go. So we can pause this. So these people here, let's just see the height there. How much is she clipping into that? That's not clipping too much. I think that's pretty good. Let's see this person. She's not clipping either. Oh, he's not clipping either. So it's just this first bit here. Um, and I will go edit and it'll be this piece here. Edit and it will be this piece, won't it? Yep. Yeah, it'll be that one, yeah. So this piece here can now be moved to... Um, but the... Grid size, grid height, just for this piece. So if I go there, just here, will that will that work? Can I put him just there? Yep, and then that shouldn't affect too much about what it's doing now. Let's have a look. So these people can now walk on and jump up. Yep, that's good. And they do really take a bit of a long road along here, don't they? They come all the way along there. Um, they don't sort of go into this area, which is interesting. So we can, we might be able to do something there. I don't know if we can place props there or something, but yeah, this is pretty good. These guys are jumping in. In fact, they're about to go. Cool. Oh, look at that. These things extend back. This is a, <laughs> this is a really cool ride. I just think this one's, uh, this one's lovely. Yeah. Okay, um, let's see if we've got a bit of symmetry happening here or not. So around the sides, we've got the exits. Hmm, okay. All right, let's see what else, how else we want to make this go. So we go walls. Um, I think what we'll do is we'll go here and we'll put on towers, yep. So I think we'll just drop these down a bit. Hang on, these guys here into the ground. 
So they'll be up. I can go one, two, three, and duplicate so we can get this guys to be in. Let's do this here, and so they go there, and the last one there. Now <clears throat> that makes for a very square building, which I don't think is going to serve our purpose. So let's do something here. Let's go uh, delete. In fact, let's oop, undo that. Let's delete this bit. And it's going to be like this. Put him there because we know he's going to go there in a sec. Yep. And here and here. Yes. And then I think as well, what we can do is we can get this next bit. We can sort of do the, a good kind of nice kind of height thing happening. sort of lined up with that. I think that kind of lines up nicely, doesn't it? Oh yeah, maybe not. Yeah, might just go in a bit and then Z. Yep. Yeah. Um, that's kind of good. So that's there. I probably should have just used the um, duplicates there, but I didn't. bits here, so no. Yep. And this is going to be with him and duplicate him. So that's all pretty good. Um, now, this is interesting because we don't want to don't want this to obstruct this ride too much so the ride's kind of got to be it's got to be visible here and you should be able to see it but it's got to be just kind of it can't be too tall but I tell you what it can be is uh, mm, 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 mm. Okay, we can definitely get this going in here. Um, so I reckon this might end up being a bit more of a time lapse um, for when we do buildings like this, because this is just taking taking a while and we're sort of making changes and things like that. Um, but what we might do is, um, so let's drop this down a bit. We, we, we leave that. Yeah, let's leave that like that. And let's do something. So maybe we'll block we'll block it there. The music's great, I like that. The music is good. Um, Okay, these bits are going to be like this. 
And so going to be a bit of force perspective going on there with these guys, so that's good. Um, let's put him in there. Um, just trying to get the same height there as the other one. So if I can just see here, grid placement, so he's there. Oh, what is going on? So if we can do this, that's kind of, um, that's kind of the height. I think that's good. Yeah, and then I put this guy in. Yeah, nice and low for these guys, please. Nice and low, thanks. Yeah, that's good. I think that kind of works. All right, so if I go here, 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 and here, duplicate that, and we go there, and duplicate that, and we go there, these will be the same height, which is nice. And then we want to duplicate this and this. There. And he blows off that steam whenever it sort of starts up, doesn't it? Yeah. And here and here. Yep. Okay, so that's kind of good. We like the height of that. I think it's all pretty cool. Um, let me see if we can just get some other things happening here because maybe what we could do is yeah maybe we could do this Maybe we could really build out the inside of this. So we've got like a separate kind of Z, uh, yep, a separate bit. And it's kind of like a fake, a fake bit, like a fake sort of, um, what am I trying to say? Yeah, it's got like a fake wall, you know, maybe, um, let's just see here, we've got the building there, yep, we'll do something on that corner, because that one's obviously not quite what we, where we want it, in fact, if we just take this off, take this off, we can move that, and we can actually put it back a bit, so if it goes back there, we can actually get somewhere, yep, there we go. So that's a nice join there, which is good. Um, and in fact, we just need to go down to the ground a bit. We're in the ground, are we? Yep, yeah, we are in the ground. So we'll, we'll finish that bit off in some way. Hmm. Okay, so we're covering up a bit of the, bit of that. It's good because it makes the outside of the building look big, uh, but the inside of it sort of is the right sort of size, which is nice. And it encloses it in a little bit too, which is good. So I think it gives you a couple of different kind of perspectives from the outside. The whole ride looks giant from the inside. It's, it's enclosed quite a bit, which is, I think, nice. Um, and then if we go here, we should be able to do this like this. Yeah, and then if we do that, is that sort of, yeah, because I think that kind of allows everyone to be enclosed in the ride nicely. Yeah. And then there, um, what we can do is we'll do, we will do,
Hmm, that's going to be a problem. Okay, um, I've got to think about how I want all these parts to play out, but <clears throat> and whether I want this sort of walkway to be anything. Um, yeah, okay. I like that we've got a few things happening here. I think it's kind of good. Um, it's a little bit of a castle there, and we'll be able to... Um, well, it's a bit of a castle, but don't forget, spooky. So we're going to spooky this right up. Um, we're going to put, um, <clears throat> you know, lots of smoke and um, get really into the spooky scene. In fact, I know the episode's gone fairly long, but let's just have a quick look now at the spooky theme and uh, content pack. Spooky, please. Yeah. So this, these are the things that we'll be able to put throughout the park as we go lots of fences um you got the you know all the animatronics spiders um and yeah and even these look at these gravestones and things um you got all the lanterns and things which are going to look really cool once they're placed in all the the right areas um uh, so these are they're spooky is that spooky scenery and that's it it's kind of yeah. What's this? Spooky gargoyles. We can put those on as well. Um, picture frames. These are all a bit sort of dark rides, so we can get into that. Um, if I just put this in here and go uh, more filters, content pack, spooky. And we'll see what building items we've also got. Crypt archways. Um, just trying to flesh it out a bit and these are what we can build with so that's all kind of good um, we'll put in a um, yeah so we're gonna put lots of different things in we we've got to you know the castle looks a bit sort of plain at the moment um, it's supposed to just it's supposed to be, just be a bit of a set piece um, a bit of a welcoming piece and people will come to it we can put a, a mural on this welcome to spooky park or whatever it is um, and people can um, can have a look at it like that so that can be, that could, could be quite nice um and lots of trees so this will all be nestled um and very nice yes well i hope you liked the first episode uh please leave a comment leave a like don't forget to subscribe check out my other videos and um and channels and playlists um we're doing sunset studios we're doing uh porter stitch in city skylines a new uk town um and that's coming along really well and um yeah i look forward to seeing you in the next episode cheers